I don't even know if I'm gonna actually post this video but let me film it anyway what's up you guys and welcome back to my channel I'm, I'm not even in the frame properly let me just oh, oh there we go now I'm in the frame anyway hi guys and welcome back to my channel it has literally been a while since I've sat in front of the camera and posted anything on this channel which is why I'm making this video today today's video is very impromptu and not planned at all but um, if you guys can think back to or go back to the first video I kind of posted like this I was talking about my anxiety and I named it what did I name it live chats for no reason so because this is another one of those videos live chats for no reason but that title is a little bit too long so I decided to change it to random rambling it's kind of just like a life update uh, just a chit chat I don't know just gonna explain kind of what on earth has been happening because I haven't been posting in almost a month I haven't posted on my blog in maybe three months four months almost six months actually no September, August, August. Okay, September was the last time I posted on my blog, and I haven't posted on Twitter. I haven't posted on Instagram, um, in a in in a while as well. So that's why I decided to sit down and just kind of talk. Why I haven't been working on hinky pinks at all in the past month or two, and I got a cup of coffee too because what would this be without a cup of coffee? Obviously. So. <laughs> That was a really long intro, but anyway, with that, guys, grab yourself a cup of coffee, a cup of tea, or whatever you feel for right now in this Joburg heat. Let's get to the rambling. I don't even know where to start. So, obviously, like I said, the reason why I am doing this ramble is kind of just to explain where I've been and how I'm feeling right now about YouTube and blogging and everything as a whole right now. As you guys know, this year was my final and last year of completing my degree at university. And I was. this is also the same year that I started my channel. And I feel like it wasn't really the greatest timing for me to do that. To start a YouTube channel. One, because it was my final year of university. And two, because I just happened to land on that exact timing of starting my YouTube channel. The exact timing. Time, I'm not joking the exact week that the new partnership program or YouTube policies came out where you have to have 1,000 subscribers 4,000 watch hours to be monetized and everything so I just happened to be smack in the middle of that whole uh, controversy that happened on YouTube and regardless of that I still started my channel because it's something I really wanted to do but yeah that just happened to be this time but it just happened at the same time that i started my channel at the same time that all of those youtube small youtuber controversy and stuff started and it was my final year of my degree and i had so much going on we were also moving beginning of this year moving from our big house to this current house and it was just so much <laughs> but i still uh decided to do this and in in the year in this few months that I've been busy 10 11 months it's 11 months now that I've been on YouTube I've really enjoyed it but things were getting a bit too much for me um, also mind my hair it's a big as poof but I'm on holiday now and I'm not in the mood to actually straighten it something I don't actually leave the house very often now that what was I talking about I totally forgot what I was talking about what was I talking about yeah, so my channel uh, has obviously been dead for quite a while now. Hinky Pinks has been dead. And this whole year I've been filming and uploading, but I haven't been consistent with it. And I know I haven't been consistent. I've been consistent for maybe about two weeks and then I fall off the radar for like a week or two weeks. And it's just because things have been so up and down. It's been moving. It's been campus and believe me campus was okay first semester when second semester hit i was losing my mind one of the main reasons that i decided to stop posting videos was because i did not have the time at all um around october uh, around october campus got really hectic and i 
didn't have time to sit and film and edit and then upload etc etc I just didn't have time for that because you know final year prepping for exams I had assignments I had projects I had presentations and everything all crammed into the last two three months of the semester um, that I actually just packed my camera away and I was like I can leave this for a while I need to focus on my degree right now and besides that I just didn't have any new ideas for this channel uh, I didn't know what to post I didn't know what to film I had no ideas I had no original ideas even with my blog I haven't posted an article on my blog hinky pinks in so long mainly because I have no idea whatsoever on what I want to write I've had like like creativity block in my brain obviously this degree has been three years long it hasn't been easy it's been a crazy roller coaster and when I finished my last exam uh, my stomach twisted and I got to my car and I started crying because I just realized it was all over and it was like oh my god so after that final exam I got home I opened social media two days after that I didn't have anything to post on Instagram I didn't feel like filming I didn't feel like writing thinking that as soon as I finish my last paper I'm gonna like dive deep into my blog and obviously that didn't happen so I decided that I'm just gonna leave it alone for a while uh, kind of take like a detox break look I was still on social media I was still scrolling and liking people's posts and stuff but I myself wasn't posting my own content because I just wanted to leave it you know and contemplate whether I wanted to keep this platform or not and obviously I'm sitting here today filming not knowing if I'm actually gonna post this video but obviously I do want to continue with this and I sat yesterday and I got all these ideas for videos and because I'm gonna have so much more time to work on this now I also want to try I guess and not be so formal about things I don't know I feel like I'm very uh, cut and edit like the way YouTube should be kind of way when I post my videos so yeah so I feel like the past few videos that I have been posting have been very cut edit and you know trying to live up to an expectation of other people's videos or what I've seen and I haven't really put myself into the videos which is what I want to try and do I want to share more of my side rather than the idea of what I want you guys to see I don't know if I'm making sense the only thing that I felt demotivated about with all of this is seeing other people's platforms so I got deep motivated with my YouTube, mostly my Instagram and my blog because I was looking at other people, other people's, not specifically anyone, just generally I was looking at other people's platforms and seeing how well they're doing. Like what, am I doing something wrong that I'm not getting this or what it is? But then I realized, you know what, in the past year I haven't exactly tried to put my, my brand, my blog, YouTube out there enough to be recognized which is something that I'm going to work on for next year and I'm only doing this because I really enjoy sharing content with you guys the blogging platform and the YouTube um, the YouTube community is so big that there are so many new bloggers out there there's so many new youtubers out there old youtubers and everyone is just trying to fit into this huge community and the last thing that you need to do is compare yourself to the others that have been in this community for a really long time. If I have to give any advice to anyone who's looking to get into this blogging community, getting to the YouTube um, YouTube platform, etc, etc, is to just do it. But the best thing you can do is just do it for you because you really want to create content and don't compare yourself to others. Because everyone has been through this. I'm pretty sure that every blogger has gone to a point where they're just like, why why am I not like that blogger? Why don't I have this much likes? Why don't I have this much interactivity on my videos? And that's the last thing you need to do if it's something that you really love. So let's just do a quick recap, okay? I went MIA on YouTube, my blog, Instagram, etc. for about a month or so because I wanted to focus on uh, my last few months of university before I graduate. I put my all into that. I went crazy cuckoos anxious and and just just stressed out I, I i got into a cocoon and i stayed there and i didn't want to interact on camera i didn't want to post any blogs 
or anything on Instagram because I had no new ideas I was so demotivated and I just had no creativity for hinky pinks anymore and now about two weeks we are one week what are we oh we're one week into my holiday since I started uh, since I finished my exams and I'm back on camera and I have lots of new ideas and lots of new content coming for December and I'm gonna have so much more time to work on all of this so stay tuned guys got lots of new ideas coming so if you guys stick around subscribe and join the family and we can go through the last few weeks of 2018 with a big smile and lots of positivity hopefully going into 2019 with a better outlook on where hinky pinks will be going my coffee is actually still hot and i got through this whole video without actually drinking it but i will sip on it while i edit this with that i hope this kind of just filled you guys in on why i haven't been posting etc etc and if this was a completely boring video i'm sorry but like i said i'm trying to be more real on this channel now so um hopefully this video doesn't end up too long i am talking a lot right now so yeah, I'm gonna go now. I hope you guys enjoyed this random rambling episode 2. I hope you guys have an awesome day, an awesome week, or an awesome whatever whenever you're watching this. And I will see you guys all in my next video. Adios amigos! <laughs>